Riders in the Chariot is a novel by Australian author Patrick White, first published in 1961. The novel follows the lives of four characters from different walks of life who are brought together in a small Australian town during the 1940s. The novel is a complex and multi-layered work that explores themes of identity, belonging, spirituality, and social inequality. One of the main themes of Riders in the Chariot is the search for identity and belonging. Each of the four main characters, Himmelfarb, Alf Dubbo, Mordecai Himmelfarb, and Mrs. Godbold, struggles with their own sense of self and their place in the world. Himmelfarb, a Jewish refugee, feels alienated and disconnected from the Australian society he finds himself in. Alf Dubbo, an Aboriginal man, is caught between two cultures and feels like he doesn't fully belong to either. Mordecai Himmelfarb, a spiritualist, struggles with his faith and his place in the world, while Mrs. Godbold, a lower-class woman, feels trapped by her social position. Another key theme in the novel is spirituality. White explores different forms of spirituality through the characters of Mordecai Himmelfarb and Mrs. Godbold. Mordecai's belief in a higher power and his visions of the divine are contrasted with Mrs. Godbold's more practical and pragmatic approach to religion. Despite their differences, both characters find a sense of comfort and solace in their spirituality, which helps them to cope with the challenges they face. Social inequality is another major theme in Riders in the Chariot. White portrays a society that is deeply divided along lines of race, class, and culture. The characters in the novel are all marginalized in some way, and their struggles to find a sense of belonging are complicated by the societal barriers they face. Himmelfarb faces anti-Semitism and racism while Alf Dubbo experiences discrimination and prejudice because of his aboriginal heritage. Mrs. Godbold, on the other hand, is held back by her lack of education and her low social status. The novel is also notable for its use of symbolism and imagery. White uses a range of symbols and motifs to convey the novel's themes and ideas. The chariot, for example, represents the character's journey through life, while the image of the river is a recurring symbol of change and transformation. The characters themselves are also often associated with specific symbols, such as Himmelfarb's glasses, which symbolize his intellectualism and his outsider status. White's writing style is often described as poetic and lyrical, and Riders in the Chariot is no exception. The novel is full of rich and evocative descriptions of the Australian landscape, as well as the characters' inner thoughts and emotions. White's use of language is particularly effective in conveying the characters' sense of alienation and disconnection from the world around them. In conclusion, Riders in the Chariot is a powerful and thought-provoking novel that explores themes of identity, belonging, spirituality, and social inequality. Through the stories of its four main characters, White paints a vivid portrait of Australian society during the 1940s and offers a compelling commentary on the human condition more broadly. The novel's use of symbolism, imagery, and poetic language make it a particularly rewarding read, and it remains an important work in Australian literature to this day.